The legend of the white snake originated over 1,000 years ago in the Northern Song Dynasty, telling a love story about Bei Shu Zhen, a beautiful lady who was actually a white snake, and a young man called Xu Xian. To repay Xu Xian, who saved her life in a previous incident, Bei Shu Zhen, the white snake, after transforming into a young lady, went to Hangzhou to run into Xu Xian and get married to him. After marriage, they moved to Zhenjiang and opened a pharmacy store called Baihe Town on Wu Tiao Street to practice medicine and help people. However, far ahead the Buddhist abbot of Jinsan Temple held it was wrong for a human to marry a demon. So he tricked Xu Xian into making Bei Shu Zhen drink real girl liquor on the fifth day of the fifth lunar month. Having drunk the liquor, Bei Shu Zhen showed her true self, scaring Xu Xian to death. Bei Shu Zhen risked her life and stole a magical herb to bring Xu Xian back to life. But later, Fa He captured Xu Xian and kept him in Jinshan Temple. To defend her love, Bei Shu Zhen engaged in an intense fight against Fa He. The flooding of Jinshan Temple is an important plot in the legend of the white snake and also a climax of the conflict. Built over 1,600 years ago, Jinshan Temple is a well-known Chinese Buddhist temple with a long history. According to historical records, the legend that a monk in Jinshan Temple subdued a white snake dates back to as early as the Tang Dynasty. The flooding of Jinshan Temple reflects the white snake's persistent pursuit of love, truth, and justice, and also embodies a common longing showing in the four major folk loves of ancient China, the longing for good humanity and for a happy marriage. The broken bridge on the west lake of Hangzhou is closely related to the legend of the white snake. After Bei Shu Zhen failed in flooding Jinshan Temple, she and her companion, the green snake Xiao Qi, came to the broken bridge, where they met with Xu Xian, who had just escaped from the Jinshan Temple. Thus, the famous meeting on the Broken Bridge. Nowadays, young lovers like to take photos on the Broken Bridge and regard the bridge as a witness of their love. They are attracted there not only by the beautiful scenery of the West Lake, but also by the enchanting 1,000-year-old love tale. At the end of that legend, which was 80 years later, Xiao Qin defeated Fa He and saved Bei Shu Zhen so that Bei finally reunited her husband and son. The ending is full of Chinese flavor and human kindness, carrying the hope of the people. Later, Bei Shu Zhen's son grew up and became a number one scholar enjoying both success and fame, in which the traditional value of Chinese people was reflected. In 2006, the legend of the white snake was added to the list of China's national intangible cultural heritage. <laughs>